The Medal of Honor is the highest award that can be given to a member of the United States military for distinguishing him or herself through gallantry and intrepidity at the risk of his or her own life and above and beyond the call of duty. The Medal of Honor has only been awarded to 3,465 Americans since its creation in 1861. On June 28, 2005, a four-man SEAL team tasked with finding a key Taliban leader in the mountainous terrain near Asadabad, Afghanistan, came under fire from a much larger enemy force. When his communications operator was wounded, the team leader, Lieutenant Michael Murphy, took his place. Due to the extreme terrain in which they were fighting, his calls could not be transmitted. With no regard for his own safety, he moved to open terrain to get up clear transmission. While being shot at repeatedly, Murphy calmly provided his unit's location and requested immediate support for his team. Severely wounded, he returned to his team and continued fighting until he and two of his team were mortally wounded. His fourth teammate, blown away from the fight by a rocket and severely injured, escaped and was taken in by the local villagers until he could be rescued four days later. In all, 35 Taliban lost their lives in this two-hour fight. As noted in his Medal of Honor citation presented to his family in October 2007, by his selfless leadership, courageous actions, and extraordinary devotion to duty, Lieutenant Murphy reflected great credit upon himself and upheld the highest traditions of the United States Naval Service. Lieutenant Murphy was the first service member to receive the Medal of Honor for actions during Operation Enduring Freedom and the first Navy recipient of the medal since Vietnam. On May 7, 2008, the Navy announced that the name of the newest Arleigh Burke class guided missile destroyer will be named the USS Michael Murphy. At the dedication ceremony, then Secretary of the Navy Donald C. Winter remarked that Michael Murphy's name will be forever synonymous with astonishing courage under fire and will now be associated with one of the U.S. Navy's most technologically advanced, most powerful, and most capable warships.